Welcome back to Adam and Jimmy Cutubers. We here at Adam's Family Cemetery, a uh, place where they, you know, put the people at. And he's gonna dump his uh, cat ashes. So, but I'm not trying to show people names, you know. That they, they, um, they, what's the name? Tombstones. So, uh, so I'll, I'll be right here. Hey fam, just giving him some time. We at a cemetery. And like I said, I'm not gonna be throwing people headstones and stuff like that. And I just wanted to, um, you know, give him respect with her. You know, she passed in 2017. <clears throat> I know my, my asthma is flaring up real bad today. I don't know why, it's a beautiful day. And I'm over by this tree that got like some stuff in it. So I just wanted to show you hanging in it. And, um, give, you know, we're giving our respects, but, you know, that was, you know, his wife, and she had cancer. She passed away in 2017, and she was a good person. You know, I knew, uh, you know, who knew her through him when, you know, when um, we used to work together. And like I told y'all, he was my best friend, so, and, uh, I, I, you know, I did not disrespect her nor disrespect him, treat him just like a friend. <laughs> but over there, he over there talking to her. And we gonna, um, J.D. Bean, we gonna uh, spread her her ashes, they cat. You know, that was her cat. That's when he, he had got J.D. Bean for her. And uh, so he gonna spread her uh, J.D. Bean ashes over her grave. We went to, um, I love my baby so much. We went to the kidney doctor and he got polycystic kidneys. Well, he already knew that. So, you know, the doctor started him on certain medicine and some blood, blood pressure medicine. And he has to stop smoking. So he's like, baby, you got to bear with me. But this ain't the first time he stopped smoking either. So, but he's coming over so he, should, he can get, uh, get JD Bean ashes. And uh, like I said, I'm gonna be somewhat away so you can y'all can see him spreading the ashes over the grave. And he said his goodbyes. There he is. And he's gonna get a haircut today. Yeah. You ready? He's spreading the ashes, y'all. See you later, JD. See you one day, boo. Okay, babe. You crying, boo? Huh? I'm gonna give you time with your babies, both of your babies, okay? I love you. I feel so bad for him. I really do. Cause that's that is JD Bean. She loved like y'all, like everybody say, like Mary B said in one of her videos, you know, your pets are your kids. And that's true. Your pets are your kids. So I'm back at the car. Just letting him have his time. Yep. But I just wanted to show y'all, you know, we are real people doing real things in real life, you know, and I just wanted to capture it, you know. Some people might like like it, and some people might not. But I. 
That was her baby, though. And his baby, too. Because she's, uh, J.D. Bean is a cat. Well, was a cat. And she used to uh, sleep on her daddy's chest. And, um, when he would go home, because, you know, he has his own place. And he would, uh, you know, the cat would be there at the house and he would take great care. I would make sure he had stuff and treats for her and everything. And I loved her too. I miss her. But yeah, I felt so bad for him. But at least she's not hurting. The reason why she, uh, you know, he had to put her down because her kidneys started failing. She was up in age too. The cat was, but he had to he had to put her down, and he was there to see it too. But we got a couple other runs to go to. Like I told y'all, he went to the kidney doctor, and uh, now he uh, we finna we got to go to Walmart. Things. When she was in this little kid right here, y'all. Like she was a big cat and she was able to fit in this little kid. Alright, y'all. Well we finna go run the Wally's world. You okay, babe? They love y'all. They well, they love you, boo. But see you in a minute. Hey y'all, as y'all can see, we up in Wally's world looking for a stress ball for my baby. Cause he gotta stop smoking cigarettes. I know it sounds like I be smoking cigarettes, but I don't. Look at all this. Basketball. Hey, I had to do a voiceover because uh we was over there by the darts. And the darker words and it was a lot of music and you could really hear it clear so you know geneva does not like to get copyright strike or whatever so that's why i'm doing a voiceover thank you yes i'm looking at we're looking for some stress balls for adam because you know like i said he got to stop smoking so we could not find uh, nowhere not even by the pharmacy in walmart so but we was looking at the tennis rackets, a lot of stuff that we can do, you know, to keep us more active and stuff like that. So, like I told him, he's not going to be doing this, losing the weight and drinking water and staying healthy, not just for himself, also for me, too, as well. So, because I love my baby and, you know, we got to support. He supports me, so I got to support him. All right. Bikes. I don't think they got none over here, babe. Yeah, we just walking around looking. See if we can find Yeah, we just looking for something. Like I said, a stress ball, but we couldn't find it. So we're just walking, 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 and walking, and walking. And that music was just so loud back there where we were. We looking though. 